Hi, She High Lions, this is Mrs. Brown. Today I wanted to do a very quick craft with you. We're gonna make calming bottles. You might have seen them before, and if you visited me in my office, you might have even made one with me. But um, you don't need too many ingredients. Before you get started, you need to check with an adult in your house to make sure it's okay that you use supplies and that you do this activity, okay? So make sure you do that first. But you don't need too many supplies. You just need a clear bottle. It can be any type of bottle. This one happens to be a shampoo bottle. You could use a mouthwash bottle, a salad dressing bottle. This is cooking oil, yellow cooking oil. It could be any type of cooking oil, Weston, Crisco, whatever. And then this is blue food coloring. So those are the three things you need. I'm gonna add some, I just happen to have some glitter in my house. So I'm gonna add some glitter as well because it just makes it more fun. Um, but what you do is you fill your clear plastic bottle with water and then you add just about a drop of food coloring into it. You don't need a whole lot. And you shake it up. Make sure your lid's on nice and tight so you're not splashing all over. You want to get a pretty blue color. And then you add the, the glitter on top of that. If you have glitter, if you want to add glitter but you don't need it. And then I'm going to shake it back together. On top of that, I'm going to add the yellow cooking oil all the way to the top. You can see it's swirling around already. All right, and it's that simple. So inside now, it kind of looks like the ocean. I'm going to shake it up. And I'll let you check that out as that settles. Oh, cool. Slowly as you're watching it, you can kind of see everything separate, the oil and the water and the glitter all falling back in their place. So this is a really good tool that you can use if you're feeling upset and you have a calm down bottle. You can um, get your bottle, shake it up, give it a good shake, get some energy out, set it in front of you, and just kind of focus on everything falling back into place. When we're upset and we have a lot of big emotions, kind of feels like like this, like everything's a mess and um, everything is kind of mixed up and uh, it's like a storm inside of us. But as we wait and we focus and allow our bodies to calm down, everything kind of just separates out. So as you're waiting for everything in the bottle to settle, you can also be doing some deep belly breaths, breathing in through your nose and out through your mouth very slowly. You can work on your tight muscles by squeezing them and releasing them. And then you can also just maybe think of your favorite happy place. All good things to help you calm down. But anyways, I hope you have fun making this. If you do make it, let me know if you do make it. And um, hope to see you guys soon. Miss you.